Okay, so now coming back to your asset disposal. Remember, when you are doing an asset disposal, now please listen carefully. Don't misunderstand what I'm saying now. When you're disposing of an asset and the question is on cash flow, specific cash flow, guys, not anywhere else in the paper, specific to cash flow. In this particular instance, if the asset disposal is based or, or, or the question is being examined in the question on cash flow only, then you will not have a profit or loss on sale of asset. In other words, your carrying value will be equal to your... The, 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 let me say that again. Your carrying value... Your carrying value will be equal to your selling price. In other words, you will dispose of the asset at carrying value. So in this case here, you can clearly see, and once again, let's re-emphasize, we're saying only for cash flow. Nowhere else, right? Not in the income statement, not in the balance sheet question, but in the cash flow question, you will dispose of the asset at its carrying value. So there will be no profit or loss on sale of asset. Once again, grade 12s with specific reference to the question on cash flow, right? Anywhere else, asset disposal, if it is examined, you will either have a profit on sale of asset or a loss on sale of asset. But in cash flow, your selling price will be equal to your carrying value. Therefore, there will be no profit or no loss.